stayed in touch with him at all? Yeah, I got to see him a little bit over the summer and just kind of text him a little bit throughout the Big Ten season. And obviously been following him in Wisconsin for a little bit. And it's good to see him having success so far this year. He's having a really great season. And I'm excited to go up against him in West Wisconsin on uh, Wednesday. You guys have had a similar experience where both of you redshirted as freshmen and then are and are playing this year. So, yeah. I mean, have you kind of commiserated about what that's been like? Or? Um, a little bit over the summer, but I would say, I mean, obviously he's going up against Frank Kaminsky and Sam Decker, and I went up against Aaron White, you know, two um, or three NBA draft picks right there. So we both had some great experiences going up, going up against great basketball players. What have you, I'm sure you've watched some of him on TV and how he's playing. I mean, are you surprised at all at this kind of success he's had? Not at all. I think anybody who knows Ethan knows that he's a terrific person, that he's a terrific basketball player, and his skill set definitely fits Wisconsin, and he's had a great season so far. Bench had a very successful January, been kind of dipped off a little bit. How do you guys get back on track make sure you're contributing? Yeah, I think these last couple of practices have been, been doing a really nice job for us and just getting back to the basics of what was successful for us earlier in the season and earlier in the Big Ten season and just kind of getting back to what was successful for us earlier. Nicholas, what's the last couple of days been like for you guys? You had a day <laughs> off. I'm sure you worked a little bit. Um, was it was it helpful from a mental perspective, a physical perspective, collectively? I think when you get into late February, it's always good to give your body a little bit of a rest. That's always good. And then mentally, just kind of going back, like I said earlier, to what was good for us earlier in the season and kind of working on you know what things were not so good for us the last couple of games and just trying to fix those things. What has it been, do you think? Um, I think you know it could be a collective. It's been a lot of things, but I think overall, you know, everybody here is committed to getting back to the basics and doing what's right. What have you seen from Wisconsin on tape? Uh, obviously, you know, they're going to play hard, they're going to play physical, and they have some great talented bigs that can stretch you. And Nigel Hayes and Bronson Koenig are their leaders, and they do a really nice job of leading them. Say that's a